Cornella Ho, welcome back to Toddler Time. I've missed you. We're thinking about colours in our tie this term, and today we're finding things that are feral. Red. I wonder, can you spot new red things where you are? How about in this picture? Keep an eye out for more red during our rainbow song, a message from Health and Safety Jane, some toy box rhymes, and a story. This song's called Sing a Rainbow. Red and yellow and pink and green, purple and orange and blue. I can sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow too. Ma is white, Fero is red, Kakariki green. Pango is black, Mamu is too, Ate i o u. Ko fire, Harari brown, Ki karangi blue. Karaka is a orange, Ate i o u. Hi everybody, Health and Safety Jane here. Yeah. I just wanted to say it's really sad that we haven't seen you for a little while and we really have been missing you but for the whole of New Zealand we're just trying to keep ourselves safe and I hope we can get to see you in person soon but just um, everybody be kind and do everything you can to help and we'll see you back inside soon but we'll see you online. Take care, be kind and we'll see you soon. Bye bye. Who's hiding in the picture books? It's Hippy, the sheep. Ba ba green sheep, have you any wool? Yes sir, yes sir, three bags full. One for the master and one for the dame. One for the boy and girl who live down the lane. What's hiding on the shelving trolley? It's a poodle ball. Here is a ball. And here is a ball, a great big ball I see. Shall we count them? Are you ready? One, two, three. This is the story of Little Red Riding Hood and how she met a wolf one day. Little Red Riding Hood and her dad lived in a cottage by a wood. One day, Little Red Riding Hood's dad asked her to take a basket of goodies to her grandmother who was sick in bed. Her grandmother lived on the other side of the woods in a cottage. So Little Red Riding Hood set off. But who should she meet on her walk through the woods but a wolf? Where are you going? asked the wolf. To take this basket of goodies to my sick grandmother. She's in bed. Hmm, said the wolf. Okay, make sure you stick to the path, little girl. Goodbye. And off Little Red Riding Hood went. And off snuck the wolf. Little Red Riding Hood shortly got to Grandmother's house. She knocked on the door and a voice called out, <coughs> Come in, I'm in bed. Little Red Riding Hood went inside and went to her grandmother's bedroom where she saw her grandmother in bed. My grandmother, what big ears you have. Oh, no better to hear you with, my dear, said the grandmother. Grandmother, what big ears eyes you have. All the better to see you with, my dear, said her grandmother. Grandmother, what a big nose you have. All the better to smell you with, my dear, said her grandmother. And grandmother, what big teeth you have. All the better to eat you with, said her grandmother, but it wasn't her grandmother, and out jumped the wolf from the grandmother's bed, dressed in her grandmother's pyjamas. At first, Little Red Riding Hood was scared. Then she was angry and she yelled at the wolf, no, where is my grandmother? I want my dad. The wolf was surprised and a bit scared himself. 
by little Reed's response. But, why, well, your grandmother is in the cupboard. I tied her up and hid her in there. And your dad is too far away to help you now. No, my dad can hear me yelling all the way from his house. He'll be here shortly and he'll be mad. Dad! This made the wolf quite scared. And sure enough, soon he could hear footsteps. Oh, said the wolf. And he ran out the back door and way through the woods. So little Red Riding Hood and her dad got their grandmother out of the cupboard, untied her, and they all enjoyed a big basket of goodies for dinner. The end. That's all for today. Thanks so much for joining us. And a big thanks to Richard, who drew the pictures for our Little Red Riding Hood story. If you live in the Waipa and you're missing us as much as we're missing you, Dee and Heidi are doing Wiggle and Rhyme in the Park on Tuesdays. You can go to the Waipa District Library's website and book online to attend if you like. Thanks so much for joining us today. We'll see you next week.